Okay, so here's the situation. We have the radar station. We have the plane one mile up. And then the plane is flying by. So we're going to call the distance the plane has gone since time zero d. We want to find the distance as a function of time, and we're told that the rate or the speed is 350 miles per hour. And we're used to the common equation, distance equals rate times time. So if we substitute the rate in there, we get distance equals 350 times t. Now we have the distance s, which is the distance from the radar station to the plane. That's like the hypotenuse of a right triangle. And we want to express s as a function of d. So let's use the Pythagorean theorem, and we have s squared equals 1 squared plus d squared. We can square root both sides, and we don't need the plus or minus because s is just a length, so we know it's going to be positive. s is the square root of 1 plus d squared. I simplified 1 squared, it's just 1. So there's s as a function of d. And finally, for part c, we want to find s as a function of time by finding the composition of these two functions we just found. So we're going to put the d function we're putting the d function inside the s function. So that's going to give us s equals the square root of 1 plus 350t squared. And if we want to simplify that, we can go ahead and find out what 350 squared is. Grab a calculator for that. That would be 122,500. So we have s is the square root of 1 plus 122,500 t.